Hello everyone, welcome back to Extraordinary DIY. So in today's video, I am going to show you guys how to make some super cute fall DIYs. And this video is a collab with Megan Weller, so I'm very excited for this video. And she has an amazing channel with amazing content and obviously an amazing personality. And she's also doing DIY fall room decor. And uh, check her video after you watch my video. I will put the link down below in the description as well as on the i button in the corner. So let's get into this video. So this first DIY is kind of silly because it's just a quote written on a tree log. And I've actually never seen something similar to this. So I'm really proud of like coming up with this idea. But what you have to do is just write a quote on a tree log and also uh, paint the sides, the upper side, and just make it cute. Now onto this gorgeous tray and you have to start by painting a piece of wood and also you can paint two tree branches the size of the width of your uh, piece of wood. And these are just for the handles of the uh, tray. So I painted white as a base color since these branches are dark and then I painted gold on top of that. And now I'm using my magazine rolling technique which I've used for like already for like three DIYs on my channel and all you have to do is glue on the end and wrap your magazine around the thin stick and this thin stick is for um, to roll uh, easier and then you can just draw up your magazine and put some glue on the end so it stays together and then you can just pull out the stick and now you can cut four short pieces out of that just glue everything together and you're almost done. All you have to do then is just paint the magazines white or whatever color you like. And now onto the third DIY which is this super pretty ring dish. So you can choose paper mache a balloon. And I used wallpaper paste for this but you can also use mud fudge or anything like that. And then after two days you can pop your balloon and cut your balloon in a leaf shape. After you've done that you can just paint your leaf and I used white as base color. And after that I painted with green and to add details I just uh, used a green marker. And now onto the last DIY. So I'm starting off by just painting a ton of pine cones and also leaving some the original color and then you can just tie them up on some string and I used uh, four strings and those strings you can just tie onto a wooden dowel and you can hang your wooden dowel on wherever you want. <laughs> So I hope you enjoyed this video, thumbs up this video, if you liked it, comment down below if you liked it and what kind of video you want to see next time. Share this video to your family and friends and subscribe for more of this DIY madness. So uh, make sure to check out Megan's video because it's amazing and tell her I sent you and bye!